good morning. We've made it to Borton on the water. We're going to have a little look around here and then maybe go to the bird land and then go to Still on the Road. Matt decided he didn't want to see any more Christmas, which is why we've not gone to Warwick Castle. So let's go and see what this is. This time we were here in Borton and Water, it was so busy you could hardly take a step. So to come now is very, very pleasant indeed. It's obviously a lot cooler because it's the 2nd of January, but it's such a gorgeous place, as you can well see. They call this the Venice of England. And apparently I'm getting in the way of Matt's photos. It's as, if you, it's as if you've got a skill. I have got a skill, thank you very much. Coming down there. The ducks are having a great time. It's another lovely day. Okay. The water is crystal clear, as you can see. And the pigeons are having a cracking time. Matthew being all touristy. Last time we were here, we couldn't even get on this footbridge. They were queuing to get on it. So it's definitely karma. A bit further along. I think there's a Ford just here. This is where the Ford is, isn't it? It was, yeah. Was? Where's it gone? Well, I don't know. Oh, I hope a car comes. Carry on along the Canal River. We make it to Birdland. So we're going to go in here. I think it's about £12 and it's the only place in England that's got king penguins. So we're very excited about that. We have seen them obviously last year but it's good to see them again. Hopefully they'll be more confident today because it's cool. So we're in. Now apparently the penguin enclosure is fenced off. You can still see them but it's fenced off. Don't know what that means, but I don't think we're gonna be as close as we were in the summer. It's so quiet today compared. Honestly, this path 
last time was so busy. Little disappointed because the penguins are right over there. Normally you can get up to that wall and see them, but miles away. And conveniently, the lady told us after we paid to get in. But hey ho, what can you do? If they're having essential maintenance, they're having essential maintenance. Hello, beautiful. Flamingos are so cool. Hello, pelicans. How are you? Yeah. Look how elegant they are when they're walking. Should we get your hair done like that next time, Eli? Eh? Well, it's not really a male walk, is it? It's just fluffy. You. Yeah. Very attention seeking parrot. When you walk off, he wolf whistles you. Let's see. You probably won't do it now. No, we didn't. <laughs> so he's just completely proven me wrong, but anyway. There's a white stalk and a heron. I assume the heron's wild. But then again, why don't any of them fly away? Hello, hello. Give me an ostrich. Yeah. That's cute. Oh, no, no. Matt's taking some photos with his long lens, so hopefully we'll get some good ones that we can add. It is so quiet here, <laughs> there's literally nobody here. These are cute. Are you singing? That's a cracking zoom of the, um... there we go. Hello. You're not an ostrich, are you? You're an emu. Hello. Around, right, and fly. There he goes. We've made it to our zone. There you go. Oh, this one's stretching his wing. Oh. Look 
cutie. These are the spectacled owls. They're very educated, I can tell. And then just here is a very wise old owl. There he is. If the phone ever wants to. What's it called? Occipital blue pie. He is absolutely gorgeous. Come over. And Bill. That's a bit like a um No idea. Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's, yeah, that's a chick. I don't know what he is. He's sharing. Matt, Matt. Oh, look at his mouth face. Get a photo. Love birds. Oh, you're so cute. Hello. You're really good friends, aren't you? Hello. How are you? You're cute. Not traditionally cute, I'd give you that, but cute all the same. You're a southern ground hornbill. And your girlfriend's up there, banging away on the wood. And here are the macaws, the scarlet macaw. They are absolutely stunning yes you are are you coming over say hi here we are at stow on the wold parking was a nightmare so if you're coming here i'd recommend you just go to the tesco long stay free parking it's then only about a three or four minute walk there's a robin on that one two robins um it's only then a three or four minute walk and much easier than coming into the town. So this is St. Edward's Church. It wasn't open last time, so it probably isn't open this time either. But we'll have a little look. We're just trying to find some food. Considering these places are quiet, today compared to normal. Everywhere's absolutely rammed for food. So we've just done a full loop of the St. Edward's Church. It's closed until April so once again we haven't been able to get in. But alas, not much we can do about that. Matt, where are you going? It's absolutely beautiful here but it really is proven difficult to get some food. It's gone one o'clock got a headache because we've not drunk anything really today. We just need some food. Everywhere's absolutely rammed. So we did make it to Puffkins and had a restaurant and we had some food and we've now made it back to Stratford upon Avon. And just outside Shakespeare's cottage again and we're just getting in a few more thousand steps before we have an Indian takeaway. 
but all of the shops, as you can see, are just beautifully done. They're so cute. So yeah, we've already done 10,000 steps, but new year, new us. We're getting a few more thousands in. So it's quarter to four on oh God, Tuesday evening and we got back from the Cotswolds a few hours ago and we've had a really, really great time. Highly recommend Stratford-upon-Avon. Highly recommend going to the Royal Shakespeare Air Theatre. Now, our friends before we went exp ex like told us that there were loads and loads of stunning restaurants which we didn't really go to but they did look absolutely fantastic so I would recommend going to them if you're there and if and when we go back we're going to definitely try some of those other restaurants so back to work tomorrow next holiday is in I don't know six or eight weeks or something like that we're going back to Centre Park with my mum and then April May time we're going on a cruise can't wait so thanks for watching it's just been a really short mini mini vlog this one but I hope you've still enjoyed it if you have please click the like click the subscribe button and we'll see you in Centre Parks if not before take care everyone bye